I'm Tom Merritt from Daily Tech News Show. Here are the top five military technologies we all use every day. Contrary to what popular culture might lead you to believe, military technology isn't just about guns and explosions. In fact, you probably used some kind of military technology today, maybe several times. Let's see some examples. Here are the top five military technologies civilians use every day. At number five, drones, AKA unmanned aerial vehicles. Whether it's for film production, emergency services, or just as a hobby, quadcopters and other kinds of drones have become a feature of modern life. The use of unmanned aerial vehicles started more than a century ago when Austrian forces laid siege to Venice using incendiary balloons. Of course, since then, militaries have developed more sophisticated ways to use remotely piloted aircraft in missions too dangerous or expensive for crewed aircraft. Today, drones, both big and small, are a normal part of any military's arsenal and a regular favorite of photographers. Coming in at number four, handheld two-way radio. The handheld two-way radio was developed for the U.S. Army during World War II as a replacement for that big bulky backpack you see in the old movies sometimes. Motorola's SCR536 Handy Talkie was the first widely used model, had a three foot long antenna, weighed about five pounds, and had a one mile range over land, extending to three miles over saltwater. After the war, surplus radios found their way into civilian hands, and now folks just use them while camping and stuff. Up to number three, radar, the, the machine, not the character from MASH. Radio detection and ranging, or radar, bounces radio signals off objects and monitors the return signal to determine about where the object is. It was used by all parties in World War II, and after the war, radar made its way into civil aviation as a safety tool, both at airports, of course, and inside planes. Other civil uses for the technology include meteorology and traffic enforcement. Sliding into number two, satellite navigation systems. The U.S. Department of Defense developed the use of orbiting satellites for navigation starting in 1973. Civilian use was allowed by executive order after a Korean airliner was shot down when the pilot accidentally flew into the USSR in 1983. Subsequent directives have made GPS free and undegraded for civilian use. And while GPS is the best known satellite navigation system, there are others, including Europe's Galileo, Russia's GLONASS, and China's Beidou. At number one, the internet. I'm on it right now. In the mid-1960s, the Pentagon's Advanced Research Projects Agency, aka DARPA, funded a project to create a distributed computer network to share computing resources between labs. And, you know, it could also maintain command and control in the event of a nuclear attack. Nice side benefit. And today we use it for memes. Now, this isn't an exhaustive list of all the technologies used in civilian life that could be traced back to military research and development, but what would you add? Let us know in the comments. And if you'd like more great tech news and info, be sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Hit that like and subscribe button. If you're not on YouTube for some reason, youtube.com slash daily tech news show. We have a podcast, dailytechnewsshow.com. And if you get a little value, maybe drop a few coins at patreon.com slash DTNS. I'll see you there.